Okay, round one against, oops, Divine Dance. I've got a Nexus Pilot in my hand, so I guess I'll play that. <laughs> Pretty good turn one. I could even Warmonger mod it like a Psychopath and just make a, like, 12-8. Mm, that's definitely not the play, though. Zithian Rot found sh uh, shrinks itself whenever <clears throat> you put a creature in front of it. So I'm dealing 6 damage to it here. I can put pretty much anything in front of it. Uh, like I could put the Pulse Mage in front of it. That's probably the best play. Because then you'd have to play another Magma Hound or something like that to kill it. And the play Pulse Mage lives, which none of my other creatures would. And then I don't have that many Tempest spells. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. And I don't think I've played any. Oh, plus the 3. Yeah, it's a third of my deck. Might be worth playing this. Well, Tactician levels really well. Uh, I'll just. I think my goal is just to play defensively and level up with this deck. I don't mind replacing the Pulse Mage I put in the center lane. It doesn't really do anything there. Whereas my Sky Knight and the Tactician will. Well, I can just give that minus 4 attack and then attack into it and then play. Wow, he's a lot of those things. This card is really good at rank 1, but at rank 2 it loses minus 3, minus 3 whenever you put anything in front of it. So it's like a really good blocker, but a horrible attacker. So I'm just going to shrink that. Attack it. Then put... Actually, do I attack it? Yeah, I, I attack it. And then play the Sky Knight Glider over here, and then the Volve Tactician in the middle lane. Yeah. Well, that was lucky. Drawing the two Stonefish Giants right before I leveled up. Stonefish Giants, the best level two card in my deck. Nine thirteen is absolutely huge. It's, I guess it's not bigger than this guy, but that guy just dies to everything, so it's not that surprising. Did he pump that, or did I just miss miss everything? Yeah, I just didn't figure out how to count. My downside. <laughs> Ooh, Grimdown Predator is really good. Uh, I think I'm gonna play Stonefish Giant here and then meta transfer his Grimgot Predator and then level my Stonefish Giant. Oh, I even drew a, uh, a combo Flame Shippers Vaunt plus under level Tempest spell. So now I can kind of sucks to like flame lance a grim Rat predator after I've already meta transferred it, but I mainly played the meta transfer to level the stonefish giant, so that's fine. I got I can just block the grim Rat predator with the flame shaper and then I kill his Nikon. Because if he spare leashes this, it's actually pretty difficult to kill. It gets a regen whenever something dies. I don't really care about that. It dies to uh, almost anything. So I can flame lance his Nikon, kill his Scavenger Scorpion, because if I don't kill Scavenger Scorpion now, it just grows up until it is a 6-6 again. Whereas this way I kill all his creatures except for the Primordial, which is left at 1 toughness. Priming for a Magma Hound. Um... <clears throat> Trying to figure out what the best play is here. I can deal six damage to this Rot Fiend and then play Matrix Warden, but that's too much damage. That's I think I just need to do four damage to it to put it to nine and then Matrix Warden up this guy. Yeah, so here's what we do. We play Matrix Warden here, kill his Primordial, pump my Flame Shaper's Wand, play Magma Hound. With the Flame Shaper ability, we hit the Rot Fiend because then it would die. And then with the Magma Hound ability, we hit the Stonefish Giant, so that it dies. So everything dies, no one has anything. And then we draw a bunch of level 1 cards. We need to draw that Nexus Pilot pretty soon here, I think. Or one of the Stonefish Giants we have two of. We only have one turn to draw both of them. <laughs> it's probably not going to do it. I haven't seen any kill spells from him, but I still didn't level this Battle Droid last turn because that's, you know... Not that great if he doesn't have anything. 
Uh, this can only be a 6-6 six, six at rank 1. So I think I'm going to play Nagrath Bruiser in front of his guy. I'm just like playing really defensively here because I am I know I have the late game. He's played too many Zithian Roth Fiends. <laughs> so I pump my own Nagrath Bruiser and then pump my own Matrix Warden. That way it kills both of his creatures. Hopefully my Nagrath Bruiser gets to live. Man, not trying the Stonefish Giants kind of sucked there. Stonefish Giant is, what, a 13-24? 16-24? Rank 2? 3? So we pumped his Necro Slime with the Flesh Fiend. Or, yeah. Played a Night Gaunt. Uh, I can give my creatures armor. That doesn't really do a whole lot. But it's better than nothing, I guess. Then I can play the Pulse Magic Wii over here. Just avoid combat for a while. And then shrink the Night Gaunt. It's powered by 6. And I drew all level 1 cards again. That's fine, I'm getting used to it. Maybe I'll draw one of those Stonefish Giants eventually. Rot Fiend kind of sucks. We've got a 6-8 though. Nexus Pilot's not the, the worst under level card, for sure. <clears throat> I'm gonna shrink his Night Gaunt because it's minus 6 power. I could shrink the Wind Primordial so he can't kill it, but I think that just ties to anything, so I'd rather shrink his creatures that are killing me now by 8, really? I thought it was only 6. Holy crap, this card's insane. That's permanent too, that's not getting that power back. Um. Do I need to play a Vault Tactician or a Flamestick Shaman? They, are the, they scale the same, right? Well, pretty much. The Flamestick's a little better. I guess I can play the Flamestick here just to kill the Nikon eventually. Yeah, maybe. One day. And then attack. Get him for six. And then play the Nexus Pilot over here. Kill his Rothfiend. <clears throat> well, I drew a Tactician. This is definitely no Battle Tactician. This is Nexus Tactician. Ugh. I, knew, I knew that was going to happen, I just couldn't stop it. I didn't see how he pumped his Night Gaunt. Did he not? Did I just miss Free Pulse Mage? It's only until end of turn. Like. Am I crazy here? I thought this was permanent. No, it is this turn. Oh wow, okay. That's embarrassing. Well, can't stop the level screw, which sucks, because I want to stop the level screw. I just block the Scavenger Scorpion because it has more power than Nikon. <laughs> And draw some level 1 cards. <laughs> this is absurd. Why am I getting punished so hard? I drafted a bunch of cards that prevent this. Ah. 